Good evening, this is Faye from Faye Faith in God. Uh, today I want to talk about how important it is to be in the Word, and reading your Bible and the Scriptures. Uh, not only does it bring you up uplifting, but it also helps you to get closer to God. So, here's a little thing that I wrote. It's called, and it's Paul. One of the disciples in particular made some strong statements regarding God's word. He wrote, All scripture is given by inspiration of God, and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction to rightness, righteousness, that the man of God may be complete, thoroughly equipped for good works. 2 Timothy 3.16-3.17 of the New King James Version. Uh, well, first I want to apologize for having a cold, so if you hear me hack up a lung, well, that's because I'm hacking up a lung. Um, anyway, back to the word. God wants the best for his children, and that's why he's given us his word, which states, Paul, is profitable to us. One of the wonderful features of God's word is that throughout its pages we can discover wisdom for every area of our lives. The wisdom comes in the form of doctrine, reproof, correction, and instructions that we are found that are found within. As followers of Christ, abiding in the Word must be a non-negotiable because we cannot do it, do what it says without knowing what it says. However, as we take to heart the Scriptures and apply them obediently, we'll find ourselves becoming strengthened in our faith and equipped for our calling building our life according to God's wisdom and ways. That's why we can't just let our Bibles sit on the shelf. The scriptures are pivotal to building a life that endures both now and for eternity. Without a con consistent diet of God's word, we'll never grow into the fullness of our identity as sons and daughters of God. So let's dust off the Bible and start in the word. Okay, this video is just short and sweet. Uh... Basically, get out your books, guys, and read it. I try to read my Bible probably, oh, three to four hours a day at least. Um, I have an audible version, and I have three or four different kinds of Bibles. Uh, King James Version, the new King James Version as well. Um, all types. I, I, I can't get enough of the Bible. I constantly find myself wanting to read it. Um, when I wake up in the morning, that's the first thing I think about. I have to hurry up and do my other chores first so that I can go back and get into the Word. So, I hope that you guys will practice getting into the Word as well. And once you do, you'll be like me, I'm sure. You can't get enough. Well, anyway, that's it for today. I'll talk to you later. I may do another video, so be, uh, be weary. There might be another one coming. You guys have a good day, and I hope you all are blessed with God.